So now we will go for the self synchronization. Yeah. Self synchronization. So what is meant by self synchronization? So when you have the infection, so the people will have infection. So in these cases, we will get the self synchronization. So here, the synchronized cell means they are made joint cell. It will become as a joint cell. So those joint cell will become as a massive attack of our other cells. Yeah. So when it will happen, see this one. This synchronization will happen. When it will happen? So when which conditions it will happen? We need to discuss that one. So first one is. So when you going to go uh, discuss about cell synchronization, first we should know that infection. Infection. Okay. So when you when you have a virus molecule, when you have the bacterial molecule, when it attacks to our body, in any patient, it attacks to the patient. First it will cause the immunogenicity. That's called as antigenicity. Yeah. So any virus, any molecule. any molecule first it enter into your body a foreign molecule first it will stimulate our immune system it will stimulate our immune system it may be primary immune system or maybe secondary immune system so it will stimulate it so ultimately our body will respond that one our body will respond to that one so ultimately we can get a immune system will get against that to the our molecule so it'll fight with that molecule to kill that one to phagocyte that molecule clearly to phagocyte our what is that virus or maybe bacteria so it'll be phagocyte So the second stage is gone. It gone to the second stage. I mean, our body will not have the. It won't be responded. It has been given not proper response. Maybe immune system has been not given proper response. So ultimately, the cells will go to the second stage of infection. Second stage of infection. That's called as infection stage. So first one is we have a symptoms. Okay. First case we will see find the symptom like a headache, <coughs> or vomiting, and like the symptoms you will get it. So when you have the fever like this, so the fever will get it. So vomiting will go. So first stage of uh, infection is called as symptoms. So any people, any people will have symptoms will come. So when these symptoms shall be reduced down, so ultimately we can call that curing of disease. But you will go to second phase. The second phase means our body will not have the proper immune system. Proper immune system ultimately it goes to the second stage of infection. So in this stage, what will happen? The cell suppose this is a cell. This is a cell. This cell will come and attack. Foreign molecule has been come and attack on this one. Okay, clear. The common molecule come and attack on this one. It will infect your whole cell. It will infect our whole cell. It will take a control of this one. It will take a control on this one. So far, it will index this DNA. It will contaminate the, this cellular DNA. It will contaminate the this cellular DNA. It will produce the own cells. Instead of producing these cells, it will produce this this type of what is the infectious cells will produce it. So ultimately, the count will be increased. The count will be <coughs> increased. So, uh, initial phase of infection, we can't find that one. Initial phase of infection, we can't by find with with your my what is that uh, uh, rapid kit method. <coughs> so we have a uh, kits, we have it. Rapid kits, we have it. In those kits method, we don't find it because the the concentration of the cell will be very less. So when will get infection actually? So the count of the cells has been raised down in our body. The count of the cells has been raised in our. Suppose a foreign molecule, a virus has came in our body. This count first initially only one will come. Other group of molecules, colonies will come. And this those colonies will attack any other cell. So only one cell will get affected. But no other cell will not get affected. So in <coughs> the days goes on. When the days goes on, ultimately along with the cell whole tissue will get infected. Whole tissue will get infected. At this stage, so this this tissue will lose its control. This tissue will lose its control and form the joint cell, and form the joint cell. All the cells come to combine form a united form. To take a control, to take a control of all the cells means you are going to synchronize it. Means when you combine that one, we'll get a synchronization form. At this stage, we can't treat the disease. Maybe we can't treat this one. So again, we need to go to the high doses of levels of the drug molecules. But initially, we can go with drug molecules. We can stop that uh, inf infection. <coughs> But if you go to the second stage, we can go find that the treatment is very rare. We can say we can see the treatment very less condition. This this is found in our cancer cell lines. So main of the main main case. So die. I think we know that. So when your cancer is infected, the people they say that we are advanced stage. The patient is then advanced stage. We can't treat that one. So we we have we don't have any in a hand. Doctor will say that I don't have this my hands. 
So when you go to the initial stage, doctor will say that, okay, I can treat that one. But final stage will go that, so doctor will say that, so I don't have a I'm in my hands. So I'll try for that one, like this. So because here, the whole tissue, the whole tissue, what will happen, so ultimately infected, the forms a one synchronized phase, means it lost the control. It lost the control of the whole tissue. So ultimately it will spread the disease. It will spread the disease, that's called as synchronization stage. So synchronization stage, right on. Can you define that? Synchronization can be defined that. Infectious stage are advanced stage of infection. Advanced stage of infection. It won't go to the advanced stage of infection. It won't go to the back. It won't go to the back. Otherwise, it is also called as pathogenic stage. High pathogenic stage. High pathogenic stage. High pathogenic stage. So ultimately, the number of number of cells means you need a unit of cells. Unit of cells means more than hundred cells. More than hundred cells they form the one gene cell. One gene cell. So before synchronization only, before synchronization only, we can identify the disease. We can identify the disease. So here our molecular biology experiments, our molecular biology PCR. Just example, I can, we can say that, so any DC you want to identify that, we can go with PCR. The PCR is a powerful technique to identify any type of disease. So in this case, so when you want to identify the disease infection, suppose best example, I can take with the HIV virus. <coughs> I can take with HIV virus. Suppose the patient has been infected with HIV virus. So initially, on first day, it has been infected through blood transfusion. Okay. So first stage, we don't identify that one. We don't know that. So the HIV is entering into his body. Now uh, it will give the stimulation to your immune system. Your immune system has been raised on the person, particular person. Immune system has been raised on. It won't be on proper. He didn't take the proper diet. So ultimately, he go to the second stage. He go to the second stage. In this case, <coughs> these people, so one to six months, it will take the so first stage of infection to it will go to the uh, second stage of infection. That's called as synchronization stage. It will take around six months. Take around six months. So at the six months only we can identify that. How? Why means the count of the cells? The count of the cells means infected cells. Are the count of the foreign molecules? Are the count of the bacteria? Suppose the bacteria is infected in our body. The count of cells has been raised in our system. System means blood. Otherwise serum. Otherwise other cells. It has to be raised down only. Then only we can identify that one. Like that. One more guest example, you can say that. What is that? Uh, uh, corona. You can say that? Corona. In this Corona, also they will say that when you have an element by the Corona, they will say 20 corats, 40 corats, 80 corats. They give you the different uh, corats they are given. So, what is that one? So, these corats means the level of infection. The level of infection, the level of cell infection to your particular lung tissue. Particular lung tissue. <coughs> Antibody will go that. Finally, 80% means they, have to go, they, have, they take, do, 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 do the patient to the hospitalized. So based on the coronal levels, they can go for the hospitalization. So, but in case of HIV, <coughs> before 6 months, we can't identify that one. We can't identify that So, but by using PCR, by using PCR, even that's called as sensitive concentration, otherwise minimal concentration, nanograms. So when you have the one virus is under the particular patient, we can't identify that. So for 10, we can't identify that. But you are going to be able, around 100, more than 100 has been raised down. By using this PCR, we can identify that. So the synchronization stage means the last stage of infection. It forms a giant cell. It forms a giant cell. So those cells will be go to the advanced stage of final death. Some it may be sometimes it may cause death also. So any disease will come. It means especially for cancer. So the people has to identify that properly. Otherwise, it will go to the death condition. So, but now uh, those synchronization stage has been uh, cured. Means we can go for treatment of the cancer synchronization stage. We can use the two types of tre treatment we can have. One is chemotherapy. One is chemotherapy. Other one is radiation. By the radioactive molecules. <coughs> chemotherapy means simply they'll give the high doses of drug molecules. They'll give the high high doses of drug molecules. So the higher dose of charge they can give. So actually, when you take the 
sorry so when you have a fever we only will take one antibiotic yeah so we take antibiotic ampicillin amoxicillin oxalin avi istromycin istromycin you can take the one antibiotic per day doctor will write that so only 50 m 500 mg per day will write that you are not supposed to more than that one otherwise at least you will write two but in corona time you are used to take three you used to take three molecules of antibiotics they refer the what is that diso doxycycline and azithromycin they refer as doxycycline and azithromycin high dose of uh, azithromycin they refer this one so 150 500 mg means 150 mg you have to take that one so those molecules will go and attack on our cells so ultimately the synchronous cells will get destroyed but patient will become very very lean because he will become as a it will get more suffered so when a patient cancer patient they are treated with chemo chemotherapy chemical therapy it's called chemotherapy it's called chemical therapy otherwise they will give us a particular radiation the part will be get exposed to the particular radiation we have a radiation instrument we have radiography we have it so the cancer patient they took the uh, radiography instrument they will place the they will expose this particular organ to the radiation so to, to kill that synchronize cells clear yeah. so here the synchronization means simply we can say that the cells they have the uncontrolled cells the united cells they combinedly act as one molecular action they will go with one molecular action so before in, in initial stage of infection we don't have any action but in synchronization stage they'll have the bunch of molecules they'll send the bunch of molecules they'll send the bunch of virus to the human body simply they'll send it just example hiv acquired immunodeficiency no they'll send the whole molecules so our system has been responded immune system has been responded but it's sending more than enough to lakhs of molecules send it lakhs of virus will send it our immune system has been recognized that one again it has stimulated that one it has produced antibodies it has to express because antibodies means send it but your gene has to express clear so in your body we want to get a antibodies means so our gene has to express it has both for the protein synthesis <coughs> then only when we have to fold that then only will fall forms the antibody no but clear in your body we want to get antibody means first it has to has to be get a signal then it has to express then finally we have to get a protein this folded protein then if this folded protein has been attacked to your opposite virus so it will take time but your is in this synchronous stage the cell has become giant cell it will send the viruses it send the viruses so ultimately our body the patient body cannot be recognized that one so ultimately the patient will go to the final condition he will go for the he may sacrifice his life so here the synchronization is a very dangerous stage you can say that in sense of pathogen stage you can call as that last end of the pathogen stage is called as synchronization stage so pathogen stage and again we are divided into different types we have it initial pathogen stage secondary pathogen stage and final pathogen stage initial pathogen stage means only again here we can write acute and chronic again we can refer here acute disease and chronic disease also we can refer that one so finally the synchronization stage means we can find for that molecule so how it will be infected we can see this one so what is the amount of the cells has been count that one so finally we can say that this patient has been in a synchronization stage so finally they conclude that the synchronization stage cannot be treated this is about your cell synchronization here out